Blessed good day everyone. Welcome to my virtual class. My name is Mom J and I'll be teaching a new topic for today. So let's get ready and we will start now. So adding similar rational algebraic expressions. So when you say similar, so meron siyang magkaparehas na denominator. So bago ko to ituro, Siyempre, bumalik muna tayo sa fractions. So, add the following fractions, reduce to lowest term. So, let's have number 1. So, 9 over 7 plus 5 over 7. So, ang given natin ay similar fractions. So, inuulit ko, pag sinabing similar fractions, may magkapareha silang denominator. At kapag ganyan ang case natin, wala tayong ipang gagawin, kundi add si numerator, and then kokopyahin lang si denominator. So, gawin natin yan sa ating given. So, 9 plus 5 is equal to 14, then 7 ng denominator, magkaparehas sila, kukopyahin lang natin siya. So, our answer is 14 over 7. But then, si 14 over 7, pwede natin siyang i-simplify or i-reduce sa lowest term. So, pag dinivide natin si 14 kay 7, ang sagot natin ay 2. So, ang sagot pa natin ay 2. So, 14 over 7 or 2. Next, number 2, so 1, 8 plus 7 over 8. So, i-add lang natin si numerator. So, 1 plus 7 is equals to 8 and copy the denominator which is 8. So, 8 over 8, pwede pa natin i-simplify. So, equal siya sa 1. Number 3, so 7 over 40 plus 3 over 40. So, ang given natin sa number 3, medyo malaki yung ating denominator. Kaya pag uh, nag-simplify tayo, may pagdadaanan lang tayo ng konti. So, i-add natin si numerator. So, 7 plus 3 is equals to 10. Then, copy the denominator which is 40. So, we have 10 over 40. Pero si 10 over 40, pwede natin siyang i-simplify. So, ang gagawin ko dito, ifa-factor ko siya. So, si 10 over 40, may factor siya na. So, si 10 may factor na 2 times 5. Si 40 naman, may factor na 2 times 2 times 2 times 5. So, i-cancel natin yung common sa kanila. Ayan. So, ang natira na lang sa numerator, lahat na cancel, so mayroon kong 1 dyan. At sa denominator, may natira ng 2 times 2. So, we have... Four. So, ang lowest term ng 10 over 40 ay 1 fourth. Bakit ko ba ito ipinakita sa inyo? Kasi pag nag-add tayo ng RAE, kailangan natin siyang isimplify. So, paano natin siya isimplify? By using factoring. So, steps in adding similar rational algebraic expressions. So, the sub-step 1, write the given expressions of the numerators as 1 over the common denominator. So, una natin gagawin, isulat natin lahat ng given na numerators. Tapos, copy natin yung denominator. Step 2, add the given expressions in the numerator by combining like terms. And then, write your answer in the numerator over the common denominator. So, kailangan, pag napag so, na, ihilera na natin yung mga numerators, i-add natin yung mga magkakaparehas na terms. Tapos, susulat natin yung sagot at kailangan over common denominator. Iisang denominator lang. And step 3, simplify your answers if needed. So, kapag kailangan i-simplify, i-simplify. So, example number 1. So, we have a plus 6b over 24a squared b plus 2b over 24a squared b. So, let's have the solution. So, step 1, rewrite the given expressions of the numerators as 1 over the common denominator. So, isulat natin as 1, c a plus 6b plus 2b. And then, copy natin denominator dahil magkaparehas naman sila. So, we have 24a squared b. Step 2, add the given expressions in the numerator by combining like terms. So, write your answer in the numerator over the common denominator. So, equals. So, sa numerator natin, si A, wala naman siya kapareha. So, kopyahin. Tapos, si 6B, tsaka si 2B, they are like terms and like signs. So, add. So, 6B plus 2B is equals to positive 8B. And then, kopyahin, kopyahin natin si denominator. 
So, 24a squared b. Next, so step 3, simplify your answer if needed. Sa palagay nyo, kaya ba siyang isimplify? Hindi. So, ang final answer na natin ay a plus 8b over 24a squared b. So, yan ang ating sagot. Number 2. n minus 6 over 6n squared minus 6n plus 5 over 6n squared minus 6n. So, solutions. Step 1. Rewrite the given expression of the numerators as 1 over the common denominator. So, we have n minus 6 plus 5 over 6n squared minus 6n. Next, add the given expression in the numerator by combining like terms. Then, write your answer in the numerator over the common denominator. So, equals. So, si n, wala siyang kapareha. So, kopyahin. Si negative 6 at saka si positive 5, like terms sila, pero unlike sign, so minus. So, negative 6 plus 5 is equals to negative 1. Then, copy natin si denominator, which is 6, 6n squared minus 6n. Next, simplify your answer if needed. Alagay nyo, pwede pa tong i-simplify. Pwede pa. So, si n minus 1, wala siyang factor, so sulat. Si 6n squared minus 6n, pwede pa siyang i-factor. So, ito yung factor niya. So, we have 6n times quantity n minus 1. So, meron tayong common factor. So, kailangan natin siyang i-cancel, which is n minus 1. So, dahil na-cancel natin yung numerator, so meron na tayong 1. At sa denominator, meron tayong 6n. So, ang ating final answer ay 1 over 6n. Number 3. So, we have 5 over a squared plus 4a minus 5 plus 2a plus 5 over a squared plus 4a minus 5. So, solution. So, write the given expressions of the numerators as 1 over the common denominator. So, we have 5 plus 2a plus 5 over a squared plus 4a minus 5. So, add the given expressions in the numerator by combining like terms. Then, write your answer in the numerator over the common denominator. So, equals. So, si 2a, wala siyang kapareha sa sulat. Then, si 5, tsaka si 5, magkapara sila. So, i-add natin. Dahil like sign. So, 5 plus 5 is equals to 10. Then, copy the denominator. We have a squared plus 4a minus 5. Step 3, simplify your answer if needed. So, palagay nyo, pwede pa. Pwede pa. So, so t, si 2a plus 10, pwede siyang i-factor. So, ang factor niya ay 2 times quantity a plus 5. Si a squared plus 4a minus 5, pwede rin natin siyang i-factor. At ito ang factor niya. So, quantity a plus 5 times quantity a minus 1. And then, cancel natin si a plus 5 kasi common factor sila. So, ang natira na lang ay 2 over a minus 1. So, yan yung ating final answer. Number 4, 2x plus 6 over 2x squared plus 8x plus x plus 4 over 2x squared plus 8x. So, solution. So, step 1, write the given expressions of the numerators as 1 over the common denominator. So, we have 2x plus 6 plus x plus 4 over 2x squared plus 8x. Step 2, add the given expressions in the numerator by combining like terms and write your answer in the numerator over the common denominator. So, equals, so ang like terms natin ay 2x tsaka x. So, since like sign, so add, so 2x plus x equals 3x. And then, si 6 at tsaka si 4, like terms, like sign, so add, so 6 plus 4 equals to 10. Then, copy the denominator, which is 2x squared plus 8x. Simplify your answer if needed. So, ang ating numerator, hindi na natin siya masisimplify, pero yung denominator, pwede. So, ito siya. So, ito na yung magiging sagot natin. So, we have 3x plus 10 over 2x times quantity x plus 4. Number 5. 
5v plus 6 over 5v squared plus 19v minus 30 plus v plus 6 over 5v squared plus 19v minus 30. So, solution. So, step 1, write the given expressions of the numerators as 1 over the common denominator. So, we have 5v plus 6 plus v plus 6 over 5v squared plus 19v minus 30. Step 2, add the given expressions in the numerator by combining like terms and write your answer in the numerator over the common denominator. So, ang like terms natin ay 5b tsaka v. So, 5b plus b is equals to 6v. And then, another like term, so 6 and 6. So, 6 plus 6 is equals to 12. Then, copy the denominator. So, we have 5v squared plus 19v minus 30. Simplify your answer if needed. So, pwede pa natin siyang simplify. So, ang factor ni 6v plus 12 ay 6 times quantity v plus 2. At si 5v squared plus 19v minus 30, ang factor naman niya ay quantity 5v minus 6 times quantity v plus 5. Since wala naman tayong makakancel dyan, so ito na yung ating sagot. So, sana naintindihan nyo yung ating lesson. So, kung paano mag-add ng similar rational algebraic expressions. Try nyo naman to. Kayo naman. So, find the sum of the given rational algebraic expressions. So, wala kayong ibang gagawin kundi i-add yung numerators but make it sure na like terms sila. And then, copy the denominator. So that's it. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Until next time!